Hello everyone, I'm here to do a quick video just to show you my Hobby Lobby Dye Lot Yarn Clarence Haul. Um, I, I put a video up yesterday when I was in the Hobby Lobby showing the um, Clarence yarn that they had. When I did that video, I only bought one thing. I bought this. This is Yarn Bee Rainbow Rhapsody Crimson Poppies. It's regular $8.99 and I paid $2.24 for it. Um, I've never used this before, but I liked it. And um, so when I did that video, this is the only thing that I bought. And I left and got down the road and I got to thinking of someone that I know that's going through a, a really hard time. Look close behind me. Monster. Hmm. Um, someone I know that's going through a really hard time and crochets and maybe knits, but does not have a car. And um, I got to thinking, why don't I turn around and go back there and get a a few of those yarns that are on clearance for that person so that's what I did and I'm going to show you some of this that I got is for that person and some is not but back to this I only got they only had this one of this color I believe because I'm thinking if they had two I would have got both of them but I want to know this is excuse me Seven point ounces, nine hundred and eighteen yards, and it's it says it's a one. I don't um, I don't go by yards. I go by ounces. But I want to know <clears throat> from any of you, would this be enough to do um, a shawl? Just one of these, and if it is. Could you put in the comments what shawl would be good to make with this, please? So that's what I got the first time I went. When I turned around and went back, I got this. Um, now this is not my favorite. Scrubology. Regular $4.29, I paid $1.07. I make a lot of scrubbies, and I don't do not like... Um, any of the scrubby yarn that Hobby Lobby has. I don't like it for my scrubbies. I like the Red Heart, but I have used this before. Um, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to hold it together with another one. And maybe another scrubby or a cotton. And that will work better. I've done that before and it was okay. But anyway... Um, Four twenty nine, and I got it for a dollar seven. I'm not gonna read all the information about these because I know other people have done these yarn haul videos, and they do a much better job than me. So I'm just showing you. But this is Yarn Bee Soft Secret Light Denim, regular four ninety nine. I got it for a dollar twenty four. Nice and shiny. And I got two of them. I got two of them. I got this Rainbow Rhapsody Teal of Fortune. Same information as the other one. Regular $8.99. And I paid $2.24. Again, can you please let me know if one of these is enough to do a shawl? And what shawl pattern do you recommend? Besides virus shawl. Um, this is a Yarn Bee Soft Secret Avocado Green, regular $4.99. I got it for $1.24, and only one. They only had one. You know what? When I went back, now I did that video. I also posted a picture on my community page of all the yarn they had. And like I say, I bought that first, that first cake. I went down the road. I was probably gone from that Hobby Lobby about five minutes when I felt like to turn back and get some of the clearance yarn for this uh, person I know going through a hard time. When I went back there, 
there was hardly anything left just in those five minutes. Uh, next, I got Yarn Bee Sweet Delight prints. The color is Sparkle. I got two of them. It's regular five forty-nine, and I got got it for a dollar thirty-seven. I got two. That was one thing, at least, you know, I don't know how many days that clearance was going on by the time I got there, but um, they'd have like one, like this one avocado. Then they'd have two, like of these. They, would, they didn't have four or six or five or three of these. They only had two. They only had one of this, so it's kind of hard. Um, I do have an idea for this. For these I should say and of course you know I love cotton I love making dishcloths and pot holders and they had this crafter secret cotton regular 229 I paid 57 cents purple lavender the tag says yarn be soft and sleek Regular $3.99, I got it for $0.99. Cents. They only had that one. And this Baby B Soft and Sleek, $3.99, I paid $0.99. Cents. Only one of those, which would be good for a hat and booties. Baby B Soft and Sleek. $3.99, I paid $99 in pink. Another Baby B Soft and Sleek, $3.99, I paid $99. It has different colors in it. This is, um, the tag I think is in the bag, but this is Glow, something Glow. And uh, I only paid a dollar something, maybe a dollar seven or a dollar twenty seven. And I already have one of these. And so when I saw it, I thought I'll get the other one. And then I got this. I love this yarn, soft, super soft, sport weight. It's considered the number three. Three light, regular two twenty nine. I got it for fifty seven cents. This color is turquoise, and I got these two. Same, I mean same uh, brand and price, and then this bright orange. Some of the yarns were like this up on the display, kind of, but for fifty seven cents. And now I added it all up, and for all that, I spent, I think, 21, 21 something plus tax. And um, it just so happened that a couple of days before yesterday, so today's Sunday, Saturday, Thursday, I did a favor for a friend, and um, my friend offered me some money, and I didn't want to take it, but. My friend insisted that I take the money for what I had done, so I took it, and I uh, I put it in a little envelope. You know, I have envelopes, like, for a car and all that stuff. And um, I put it in an envelope marked FUN, F-U-N, not F-U-N-D, FUN. It was going to be FUN money for whatever. And then um, I happened to hear about this dye lot sale, and so I went and uh it turned out that my friend had given me twenty dollars and this came to 21 something plus tax and so i think that's pretty neat it's not all for me like i say um in fact i can tell you the f these <clears throat> i'm still struggling with um allergies and sinus infection i have a, a headache again today that's why i don't have my glasses on uh, What's I gonna say? These four, these four I got for 
um, the person I know that's going through a hard time. So it's not all for me. And I'll show you, I know I showed you in a video from the thrift store. Remember I showed you these? Um, I found out from Jax and Marianne, our crotchety clogger, and there might have been one other person. I found out that, oh, Kelly from I Bring It Every Day, and I think another person, that this yarn, I cannot pronounce it, um, is a high-end German yarn. So I got um, four of the same color, and then in the bag is two of the same color, but a different color, if you can understand that. And I paid... 393 which I'm hearing from these people that that is a wonderful price. I haven't taken the time because I've not felt well even to open the bag and Google any information about it, but um, I don't think anything on here is in English. And so Marianne, oh, I can tell you. Okay, uh, it says 67% polyacryl, 30% wool, and 3% polymide. It says made in Italy. It's made by coatscrafts.com. Um... It's S C H A C H E N M A Y R since eighteen eighty two. And um this other one is two percent polyamide, forty eight percent of um polyester. in 49% virgin wool. So, um, I'm going to have to do something with it because I cannot work with wool, but that's okay. I'll find it a home one way or another. So I just wanted to share that with you. And what else? Um, well, I guess that's it. Since I haven't felt very well this morning, I did not go to church. Um, I am day three or day two on the antibiotic. So, I mean, I'm safe to be around people. It's not the C that's going around. It's not a, um, upper respiratory anything. It's all, all here, but... It puts, uh, you know, pressure in my head and it, it sets off other things with that brainstem disease, the Chiari malformation. I've been sneezing, which, you know, healthy, strong people have thrown their back out from a bad sneeze. And I've been sneezing and it has um, caused some issues with the syrinx in my spinal cord, that spinal cord disease, syringomyelia. When I get sneezing, uh, it'll put that problem into spasms and cause pain down my legs. And Anyway, uh, God is still God. Nothing changes God. I'm so thankful. So I'm going to let you go. And um, I'll see if later I can't do a video showing you that jewelry holder, um, how I repurposed it. And if I don't get to it today, I will be doing it tomorrow. So just bear with me. And thank you new subscribers for coming along. I noticed there's been some new ones and I am striving for 800 this month being my birthday month. I will be having a giveaway at the end of the month that I was supposed to have in July. But I will be having it the end of this month. So stick around. And... Um, Everyone have a great day. Remember to be kind 
to everybody because somebody's having a bad day. We just never know what someone's going through. So I will talk to everyone later. Thank you.